This is my aquaponics floating mat vegetable growing system. What I have used are uh, mats that float on the water into which eight cups snap. You can join them together uh, with uh, ties in those little holes and make them as big or as small as you like. This is the size of the cup, fits into the palm of your hand. That is the mat without cups. They are solid plastic, hollow inside. UV treated, as are the cups, you can keep reusing them. To start your aquaponics system, these are the two products I have used to get the bacteria going before I put the fish into the pond. Charlie Cup you may not be able to get um, overseas but sea sol or a seaweed based fertilizer you can get anywhere. Now where's my system? It pumps out of this tank into my biofilter. My biofilter is three quarters full of gravel and coralite. Coralite is dead coral. I also put eggshells in there. From there it pumps into this tank. And as you can see the silver beet is doing extremely well. That's Italian parsley there. See the uh, mats just float on top of the water. The fabulous system of growing. Then from this tank, which is joined by 300 mil pipe, it flows into this tank. The pump I'm using to pump the water is a 110 watt pump, or just under a third of a horsepower. There I have uh, Brussels sprouts, celery, as you can see the colour is great, growth is good. There I have my Japanese vegetables. I have let some go to flower so I can collect the seeds and also attract the bees. And as you can see there is excellent root growth. Lettuce, again good colour, good growth. There you are, you can see the bees doing their job. Oh, it's gone, there it is, over here. Mother Nature at work. Here I have my tomatoes. They're about a metre and a half high. Absolutely fabulous growth. I have eight tanks that are linked together. There I have an aerating pump. And the water just circulates around. There I have peas growing. Lettuce. More greens watercress and what I have done with the watercress I have also spread my growing medium on top of the float mats because watercress will um, re-root and that gives me a uh, better harvest over here I have beetroot they've been in about three weeks three and a half weeks And then it flows back into my original tank in which I've got baby carrots growing.
the water flows in a clockwise position. Over here I have my new pond, which is a 5 metre by 9 metre pond. That is what I constructed with my tractor. This one has the capacity of a minimum of 3,000 plants in 200 mil of water. That is the roof of my cover, which I've just used poly pipe. The poly pipe I've hammered had over star pickets. This will be covered with shade cloth in summer and plastic in winter to keep the warmth in.